everybody, it's Casey the Rockstar Flipper. That is me. Uh, today is November the 17th slash 18th, 2016. Um, it's pretty early in the morning. I'm making this video uh, for you guys to see early morning, afternoon, early afternoon Friday. Um, remember tonight we have a live show, which would be Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific. It's Lindy Glenn. It's Pittsburgh Mike. It's going to be awesome. So I just want to remind you guys of that live video later. Um, right now I'm just going to do a quick little video for you guys that you have something to watch today to hold you over for the next, you know, 12 hours until, uh, we get to that live show. But make sure that you guys that are asking about how to tune into the live show, it's very, very easy. Just go to my channel, my main YouTube channel, and right when you click on my channel and it pops up with my, my featured videos or whatever, there is going to be an event. It's going to say live event starting in 12 hours, 14 hours, 18 hours, whatever it is. Just click that window and it will open up. There will be a chat window on your right hand side and you'll be able to chat once uh, everything gets going at 9 p.m. Um, you can bookmark, you can save that URL across the top there as a bookmark and you can come back to it later if you got to go about your day, go to work, do whatever you have to do. Um, or you can just at 9 o'clock come back to my channel and click on that live and you'll be able to see it. And it'll have a little red tab that says going live now. That's as easy as it is, guys. There's nothing special that you have to do to join a live chat or a live YouTube channel. Um, we do it via Google Hangout. We have private links. Those of us that are a part of the channel uh, live show, which would be me and Lindy and Pittsburgh Mike, um, that's private. That way we can invite who we want to invite, and um, the rest of you will have access to the chat. Um, because we wouldn't want just anybody jumping in and, and being able to talk and have 100 people talking. So... The three of us will moderate it and talk, and then you guys can chat on the right, and we will answer your questions as we go. So it's pretty easy. There's nothing special you have to do. That's that's it. That's all you have to do, and you're a part of the live show tonight. 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific, November the 18th, 2016, Friday, and we will definitely see you guys there. I hope to see everyone there, and when you come in the live chat, make sure you smash the like button. Um, that way we know everyone is there and everyone is enjoying the chat tonight. So let's move on to right now's video. So today's video is just real quick because we're having a live show tonight. I didn't want to make this terribly long, but people are asking me what can I sell right now, November through December, uh, that are really hot for Christmas, that are going to sell good. And Christmas is geared a lot towards brand new stuff. People spend a little more money. Um, but one of the items that seems really, really consistent and always seems to make me money during Christmas, it makes me money the rest of the year, always. But it does really, really good at Christmas. And I, I held out. I, I bought up a bag of this stuff. Probably have about 30 or 40 total. We're going to list them this week. We're ready to list them. Um, we're into each of these items. These are items you can buy for a dollar or less. Some of them 2 or $3 or less. But the cost of goods on this is very, very low. And the average sell price is between $15 and $20 on almost every one of these items. You can find them at the bins. You can find them at Goodwill and thrift stores. You can find them at the Salvation Army. And you can absolutely find them in bulk at yard sales. Now, I know a lot of you don't have yard sales anymore. So, the way that you can find them without being able to go to yard sales is to go on the Craigslist garage sale sites. Go on um, the garage sale listing sites and email, message everyone and ask if they have any of these items. You can make a list of these items that you want to buy and send out emails. You go find the items. Don't wait for them to come to you. Don't wait to just stumble upon them. Go look for them. Um, but let me show you what I'm talking about. And you guys have probably seen me buy a few of these and put them in haul videos. But we've been hanging on to them, stocking them up. And uh, they're handheld electronic games. These are Deal or No Deal. That's Uno. Uh, Texas Hold'em Poker. Um, this, one of my favorite items to buy. Bop It. Also the bigger Bop It Extremes. Bop It XTs. Bop It 2s. These all sell very, very good. Um... Also, travel games. This is a travel Scrabble game. Travel card games. 100 Wacky Things. Um, I have Phase 10 over there. Skippo's over there. I'm just looking up on the shelf at a couple other games we have. Uh, we have... Here, let me show you guys another one that we picked up. Just something as basic as a pack of rummy cards. Now, all of this stuff is... Stuff that will sell. The more, the more high-tech electronic stuff is 15 to 20. These card games can be 10 to 12. But let me tell you guys, I bought this. I bought this for a dollar at a yard sale. 
I bought this at the bins by weight for 60 cents. This is about 15 bucks, 14, 15 dollars right now. The wacky card game, probably 10 to 12. This one's brand new too. I bought all these at yard sales. I paid a dollar. I paid 50 cents. I paid a dollar. Probably 12 to 14, 10, 10. I bought this at the bins by weight, probably a dollar. 15 to 20 so you guys can see you should be able to source and locate handheld electronic games card games and travel games very very easily make a list of that you want to buy these items and go out looking for them. people will sell them all day yard sale garage sale craigslist i seen somebody one time and this was a couple months ago it's not anything i shared with you guys sometimes i don't share everything we buy because we're constantly buying but he put a lot of those electronic games on craigslist he had like 12 of them for sale and he listed them for 20 bucks for all of them i immediately messaged him he was right down the street from me i offered him 15 he said come get them bought them for 15 which was like a dollar 20 a piece or dollar 10 a piece and we sold every one of those for like 10 to 12 bucks a piece so literally um you know you can make a lot of money off of those things if you can source them Start becoming a niche person. I seen a guy on eBay that I kid you not had like 500. Instead of $515 shirts, he had $515 electronic games. So you can definitely start niching and becoming the supplier of items and becoming somebody that learns how to source this stuff constantly, consistently, and that's what you get. And your cost of goods is so low on those items. So something just to be on the lookout for, big bolo, whatever you want to call it. Electronic games, handheld games, toys, card games. All very popular during Christmas season. All very popular after Christmas season as well. Remember, January is all about the gift card spending. I'll do a video on that to show you guys just how you can make just as much money in January as you do December. Um, but enjoy this video, guys, and please join us tonight for the live show. I did this video right now just to give you guys a little something to watch until uh, tonight. This will hold you over. I appreciate you coming by and checking this video out. Thank you to everybody that's been watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you to all the new subscribers it means a ton to us our subscriber count is just going up and up and up and i really really appreciate it i i love that you guys are sharing this with your friends if you haven't please share my videos and my channel on your social media on your instagram i know a lot of you are on my instagram i see you every day um but share it with your other instagram sellers thrifters resellers if they don't already follow me on instagram please have them follow me it's just at rockstar flipper um, it's a way for me to share these videos and help teach more and more people um, how to do uh, things properly, do things the right way. Um, so thanks, to uh, thanks again, guys, and I will see you tonight with um, Pittsburgh Mike and Lindy Glenn. And a little birdie told me that today might be Lindy Glenn's birthday. So if you see Lindy or you see her on social media or on YouTube or you come in tonight, make sure to wish Lindy a very special big happy birthday. We will see you guys later tonight. Have a wonderful day.